Hello everyone, my name is Equilibrumist and this is my Witcher 1 gameplay series, episode number 8. So I still haven't figured out how to gather herbs. Still looking, still trying, but no luck. I'm not even sure if I'm looking from correct places or if I'm looking at the correct thing. Maybe this area where I'm looking from is too close to the city. Leave me be! I won't surrender my workshop for all the treasure in the world! Oh, you'll give it up, Gramps, or else. Or what? A witcher! Kill him! Not likely. Not You're oh, ours, Salamandra. Witcher. Hey. You should have left Salamandra alone. This bridge will be your grave. I'm innocent, don't hurt me! Hmm. Thank you, Witcher. You saved me and my laboratory, my beakers, my treasures. Anytime. Okay. I know all too well what they're after. To use the stolen secrets, Salamandra needs equipment. Without it, the Witcher's mutagens are useless. They almost grabbed Kalkstein and his treasures. They almost succeeded at Kaer Morin. Almost makes a huge difference. If I had stayed and fought the Frightener with Vesemir, I might have faced a different threat today. They were here for me. I made a choice some time back. Had you known this would happen, would you have chosen differently? No. It was the right decision. And I'll deal with the consequences. I'm not surprised at your answer. You don't seem like one to look back. Visit my shop in Vizima for any ingredients you need for your potions at a discount. Farewell. That formula needs... Shouldn't have defended the old man. You come talking again. <laughs> what are you going on about? The old man comes here and talks and talks. Gives me a headache. I'll stone him next time. I wouldn't if I were you. He's a powerful alchemist. Uh, Captain said only admit those with passes. I know, I know. They're moving me to Millgate tomorrow. That's where I'll stand. 
If you have a pass, look for me there. Where might I get a pass? The Order of the Burning Roses got passes. The Eternal Fire fights the plague. I've seen no knights here. Would the Reverend know anything? He knows a lot. Wouldn't hurt to ask. Farewell. Hmm. I got rid of the ghouls in the crypt. A hundred thanks, Master. Here be a month's pay. Ooh, the boys will be happy. <laughs> They plan to search for treasure in the crypt. Take a pick to one of the walls. I found a young woman's body inside. The ghouls came for her. Young woman? No. It can't be. My Elsa, I, I, I loved her. I wouldn't know her name. It appears she poisoned herself. No, no, no. It was that vile witch. The devil's whore poisoned my Ilsa. No. I'm sorry for your loss. But I need to know about Salamandra. They have passes, they do. The only ones. Leave me be. You have the evil eye. You bring bad tidings. Be gone! Don't forget to tell the Reverend I got rid of those ghouls. Farewell. Scandalous! This is the third time they've refused to acknowledge the validity of my pass. What brings you here? I wanted to ask you about alchemy. Finally, someone worth talking to. Here I thought the locals had no interests beyond their daily concerns. I'm not exactly a local. And think about it. If the locals were all interested in alchemy, they wouldn't have much need for you. Ha! Ah, typically short-sighted. Witcher, alchemy is the mother of all sciences. And do you know why? For it allows us to understand the world. All that surrounds you is none other than the alchemy you strive so dutifully to deride. Alchemical processes transpire in your body at all times. Oh, God. They allow you to eat, breathe, and excrete. What's more, they are responsible for your thoughts and feelings. Alchemy is life. We need to change the subject before the peasants decide to burn us at the stake. One cannot shut the mouth of science. But fine, what do you wish to know? How do you obtain alchemical bases? You need equipment to obtain the correct distillate. I myself use an atonator coupled with an alembic and equipped additionally with a rectifying column and a copper cooler. And if I don't have a coupled atonator handy? I see. Field work. Hmm. Olaf must have some decent vodka or spirit that could serve as an alchemical copper, base. Copper thing I understood. Where do I get ingredients? If you wish to obtain components yourself, you'll need books containing drawings and descriptions of ingredients derived from both plants and animals. Peddlers are your other alternative, but they'll rip you off. When I require monster tissue or organs, hmm. I'm interested in formulae. Ready-made formulae are rare and difficult to acquire, so I encourage you to experiment, modify recipes you already have. I Most wasn't. people underestimate the value of using the empirical method in science. I think I've heard enough. But we've only just begun. Oh, crap. You don't look like a local. I live in Vizima, but I'm just returning from a great convention of alchemists, pyromancers, and geomancers in Oxenfort. Wonderful city, which are a cradle of science. I don't doubt it. Did the convention reach any... It was an incredible experience. I presented my dissertation on... Specific? Conventions aren't meant to be specific. Then I'm not sure I see the sense. Science is... And get drunk and spend his last money on whores. I think I see the point now. Hmm. Science is like a river. Uh, sorry, I got lost in thought. You were talking about returning to Vizima. Ah, 
Yes. Because of this quarantine, I'm losing time in this inn. I have extremely important research waiting. And what am I doing? I've sent a message to my friend, another alchemist. He is my only... Hmm. Well, I wish you luck. Thank you. They must admit me. They must. Farewell. Okay. Right, I still need this goddamn. Ugh. That's unforgivable. I'm starving. Shut up. The order will defeat the monsters. Let's pray the knights arrive. Wise words. Speak quickly. Odo's and Heron's monsters are gone. For Mikkel, I cleared the crypt of ghouls. I must admit I'm impressed. You may yet defeat Salamandra. To do that, I need to know where to find them. I will say nothing until you eliminate the Beast Witcher. That is my condition. I'll see you later. Speak quickly. I want to enter the city, but I need a letter, a pass of some sort. Only Knights of the Order hold passes. But as chaplain, I have one. May I have it? You? A stranger? A drifter? Have you lost your mind? You suck. Outskirts of the village. I work too hard. I too work too hard. Do, 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 do. 
Where the hell are those plants? God damn it. Instead, how about the beast comes for you? Your legs hurt. No need to rush. Okay, so this looks to be outskirts. Or is it the place where I started from actually? It would make sense. Give up. Geralt. Zoltan, I found these strange dice. Looks like dwarven handiwork. It's poker with dice. Very entertaining. Requires less attention than cards, but it's just as exciting. Dice are a dwarven invention. Became popular after the war. Not surprising, given that every mercenary played. So how do you play? Let's shoot around, I'll show you. Oh, damn it. You bastard. Oh. 
Okay. Geralt! Zoltan, you mentioned my vanishing. Any idea why I disappeared? I'm not sure how to tell you, but you died, Geralt. Five years ago, during the massacre in Rivia, I saw some scoundrels stack a pitchfork in your gut. You bled to death on a dirty street before my eyes. Or so I thought. And I've seen enough corpses to know that there are some unexplained cases. From what I remember, witcher mutations significantly changed your body, but that makes it no easier to believe you survived. So, how are you doing? You know me, my schemes. I hope to start a modest business in Vizima, bringing in goods from Mahakam. The Breckenrigs are pressuring me. From Mahakam? Any profit in that? I certainly hope so. I made some investments due Just so long it doesn't run away. Geralt! I need to go, Zo- What can I get you? Did you want to ask me something? Where's Alvin? Abigail, a local soothsayer, offered to care for him. I hope I did right in trusting the boy to her. She seems strange. I'll look in on them. Thanks, Geralt. We'll speak later. What brings you here? Do you ask everyone for permission to examine or dissect them? Of course not. That explains it. Don't take offense. I'm merely curious. Farewell. Finally, uh, someone sensible here. And you are? Luvarden, merchant. Of those Luvardens. Of those or not, I sense you have a job for me. Unfortunately, my friend disappeared in the cave beneath Vizima's walls. You think he's dead? I don't know. I'll pay you 200 orns to rescue him or provide for a decent burial. Will you take the job? All right. My friend tried evading the quarantine to enter Vizima. Why through the cave? We heard goods were smuggled into Vizima that way. I'll do what I can. Be careful. My friend has dealt with monsters before. If he's dead, surely danger follows. I will not play dice. Sure, I'm broke. Another day. Any news? Try that. That's why I'm broke. Just in case. What can I do for you?
Well, God damn it. That formula needs rethinking. Greetings. Greetings. Okay, what Sounds a despicable like a good place. I'm trapped here with my goods while my wife and children... Why is that? Vizima's gates are... I guess we just have to wait. Most of the diseased have died off, but the beast and bandits now spread their own... Can I ask you something? Yes? What's with this plague? What of it? Tis some variety of the bubonic... To be safe, I avoid any who appear... E I'm immune to infectious diseases. My grandfather claimed the same, insisting all the while that his bubonic ulcers were merely boils. May the ground lie lightly upon him. Yes? Tell me about the beast. I overheard it described as a phantom, appearing from nowhere, murdering those with... Interesting. <laughs> Royal officials would make a true feast for the beast, and other ghosts serve it. Apparently in the form of untiring bloodhounds. I'll have to ask the locals. Yes? Any bandits in the outskirts? Indeed. They call themselves the militia and extort bribes. Also, some sect from Vizima may have arrived here. Do these men wear the salamander sign? Never met them. But if they are a sect, the Reverend ought to know something. I'll ask him. Yes? Yes, yes, I shouldn't have bought it. And hello to the chat. Them. Now to prepare the potion. How is it made? Interested in witch's secrets, are you? The recipe is yours if you swear to take it to your grave. I swear. Draw close and listen. Blend two ounces of cadaverin with the myrtle petals. Speak your name backwards, turn about three times leftwards, spit into the fire and stir the potion again. Complicated. <laughs> I knew witch's magic would be beyond the mind of a man. Grant me a moment to finish the potion. See you later. Right, so this is a good time to end episode number 8. Thank you for watching me. Follow me on Twitter, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and see you in the next episode. Bye bye.